The issue opens as we see Arkham Asylum in flames, with its inmates on the loose. With even the likes of Barbara Gordon assassinated and monsters roaming the streets, it was clearly evident that on this earth, Gotham had fallen. Things then cut to an elder Bruce Wayne overlooking the chaos that was once the city he swore to protect. In the darkness of his manor, Bruce hears a voice from behind, which we see is a scarred and much younger Batman, sorrowful that he had failed this city. We then see the man take off his mask, where we see it is this universe's Damian Wayne, who had taken over the mantle of Batman once Bruce had become too old. Not exactly being sympathetic with his son, Bruce told Damien that he was not getting the job done properly, where the young man argued back, saying that everyone they had loved, Barbara, Dick, Jason, and Tim, too had all died because they could not fit the Batman standards. Comforting his son, we then see Bruce approach his library, where he reached for a book, proclaiming that while he may be old, there still may be a way for him to help. We then see this book, which appeared to be some sort of ancient text, with a foreboding and evil energy emanating from it. Bruce then reveals that this book was passed down by an ancient cult that was founded during the early days of Gotham in the 1600s. The cult would sacrifice people that they loved in order to gain power, and the greater the sacrifice, the greater the power would be and could make them part of the city itself. A confused Damien then asked his father if he wanted him to perform this ritual to save the city, with Bruce merely replying no. Wondering just what he could be getting at, a saddened and horrified Damien came to the realization of what his father was asking. Embracing his son, Bruce apologized saying that this was all his fault. In the very next panel, we see the life leave Damien's eyes, as Bruce had pierced him through the heart with one of his own batarangs. Looking over the corpse of his child, Batman vowed he would make this right. Telling his son that he loved him, Bruce used Damien's blood to paint a disturbing and twisted version of the bat signal on the floor saying there was nothing he loved more than his city, we see the blood burst to flame, with the man walking right into it where he was consumed. We then cut back to the crime-ridden city, where its residents and criminals began to feel the earth shake beneath them, as if the world itself had come to life. Here we would see this feeling was closer to the truth than we realized, for this ritual had allowed Bruce to merge with the city itself, literally becoming an immortal physical embodiment of Gotham, swearing to finally save its people once and for all. 